Last time on Yu-Gi-Oh! Take your top off! Yeah, J Elite is just is a complete and utter perv. And he's moving <laughs> on! <laughs> so yeah, monsters uh, appeared to the city and everybody blamed Kaiba. To be honest, <laughs> why? <laughs> no, seriously. Why would they blame him? I understand he's the guy who makes the technology that has the holograms. But Even though in the monster says, if giant monster attacks, tell them we have nothing to do with these giant monster attacks. Yeah, here's the thing. Why? I mean, I get. I can at first be like, oh well, you know, the holograms. But if the monsters are literally smashing everything up, I don't think it's a hologram. I don't know. Someone's buying up every share of our company. What do you mean? I mean. Okay, okay, here's my question. Why Sadly, would Kaiba allow anyone to buy up every share of his company? He here's the thing. himself the, knows the, that if you control 51%, no one can take your company. Exactly, that's the thing. Seto and Mokuba, I think all together, have 60%. Why, why, what the, um... I think in the Japanese, though, they, it was, um... Someone bought up that, that someone bought up forty percent, which was the rest of the shares that were out there on the stock market. Yeah, it's just one of those things where Kaiba's ego, he would never risk his company. So yeah. And if they buy any more shares, they'll take control Actually, of the entire company. There's only one person I know is capable of something like this. Pegasus. What about Schroeder Corp? What about them? <laughs> Here's the thing. Here's the thing. Um, you, you are, uh, I mean, there are plenty of companies that are privately owned, but it is still a good idea to do uh, shares. I know, but I'm just saying that in the case of Kaiba, with his personality and how much he loves his company, he just doesn't seem like the kind of guy who, yeah. Well, he keeps 60% of the shares... With no, no, he just and, needs fifty-one percent. I know, but it's sixty for extra me uh, for for extra measure. Fair enough. I think it's like Se I think Seto may have like fifty-one, and Mokuba has the other nine. Who cares? Point is, we're dueling Alistair, who for some reason was able to perfectly copy Pegasus. That was weird. Yeah, like yeah, like with like with this duel, it's like he take we take on Pegasus, and you know then it's revealed to Alistair. You have to wonder, did he? What? Like I'm trying to imagine Alistair saying all those lines that Pegasus did. You know, as himself. Okay, this isn't good. At least I have the Fang of Critias. Hmm. Next turn after that's destroyed, you can sack it for judgment. That's what I was thinking. Wait, wait. Whoa, Cypher oh. Soldier. That's not good, because Cypher Soldier is going to easily kill Judge Man. Hmm. All right. Guess I have no choice. Monster Reborn Z Metal Tank. And then I'll sacrifice him for the Judge Man. Order, order in the court. I'll open this bitch. <laughs> Order the court up in this bitch. <laughs> I do like his design. It's a nice classic one. Oh, give me Don't a break! Me. I'm killing my monsters. Damn it, Alistair! What did I ever do to you? You killed my father. Uh, no, I'm sorry. You kidnapped my brother. Well, it was, well, it was also your fault. 
your father, and his name then it was your adoptive father, but you killed slash kidnapped my brother. I activate Monster Reborn, and I'm bringing your Di Dynatherium. I honestly don't know what to call it. Kill Cypher Warrior! I do actually kind of like Alistair's deck being a whole military deck. It's actually kind of cool. That, however, is a... That's Bandit Keep's card in the manga. So much in the manga in, the, in the, these past few episodes. Yeah. Huh. All right, I activate Pot of Greed to draw two cards. Hmm. Okay. I think I got something. I activate the Thing of Critias. Infuse Tyrant Wings with the bit. We're coming out, Tyrant Burst Dragon. <sighs> now we got some offense. Tyrant Burst Dragon, fire! If you win with a hundred life points, yeah, that'll be the that'll be the just ultimate win. Yeah, you, you could win one of these duels before they activate the seal. I summon is... Y Dragon Head, and then <laughs> I fuse them together to create YZ Dragon Tank. And now I activate the effect of Tyrant Burst Dragon, equipping it to to my YZ Dragon Tank, which means he gets three shots at you. <laughs> Any last words, Alistair? You're adopted. Just silently attack. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God! Now that was a great victory. Oh yeah, 100 life points left. Like Hell I, I yeah. gotta say, positioning is better than life points. <sighs> but that... That, that really... I'm sweating a bit. Yeah, that Cypher Soldier really fucked me over. So next time, we're gonna be fighting for a friend, then grappling with a guardian. And then a duel with darts. Wait a minute. What? Goddamn alliteration, dude. A duel with darts. With darts. And if you lose, we'll take your deck. I I'm sorry, you're gonna take my what? Your deck. I am going to take your deck. <laughs> you do know I'm in high unless, school, right? Unless Unless you want to be our lowest wanked man. <laughs> oh, God. Also, what is up with Alistair's outfit? Just... He likes to show his midriff, doesn't he? Yeah, it's like... It, it looks like he's got a man bra. Yeah, I know. I mean... Yeah, I mean, what? Is he taking fashion lessons from my? <laughs> Or is he, is he, like, I don't know, wearing panties? Is he a sissy? <laughs> Maybe? I don't know. I don't want to know. <laughs> we'll see you next time.